Hello everyone. Welcome to Sci Economics Point. In today's lecture, we will discuss difference between free goods and economic good. Okay. Free goods are nature's gift. Okay. Free goods are nature's gift. So no human effort is necessary, right? But economic goods are man-made. Therefore. human effort is necessary to produce economic good right next a free good is a product that does not require any resources to make it okay and so does not have any opportunity cost okay as free goods are the nature's gift so there is no resources are required to make it okay but economic goods okay it requires limited resources to produce it and therefore has an opportunity cost okay next thing consuming free good does not reduce consumption for others okay because it is not scarce in nature its supply is abundant it is plentifully available okay but the consumption of economic good they reduces the consumption of others okay because it is scarce in nature okay in economic goods supply is always less than demand right then next thing is economic goods command price in the market because it is scarce in nature okay as it involves the cost of production so it commands a price in the market okay but free goods it have no price okay because there is no cost of production as it is the nature's gift right next is free goods have only value in use it has no exchange value okay though without free goods we can't survive okay for example water air sunshine okay without it we can't survive okay life is not possible without free goods but it has no exchange value it has a greater value in use but no exchange value okay but economic goods have both value in use and value in exchange okay then next nobody owns free goods okay as i have already told you okay free, free goods are the nature script okay so nobody owns free good but economic goods there is ownership okay economic goods are owned by someone right for example book wrist watch car pen jewelries these are owned by someone okay and examples of free goods may be rivers lakes sun sun sunlight okay air water okay then next is free goods are not affected by the forces of demand and supply because it is plentifully available okay but as economic goods are scarce in nature so it is affected by the supply that means forces of demand and the supply that means the market forces right next is economic goods are included in the national income which because it has exchange value it is a monetary value okay but as free goods have no exchange value no monetary value these goods are not included in national income therefore it is not wealth in economics okay but economic goods as it has some monetary value as it has some exchange value it is considered as wealth in economics okay however the distinction between free goods and economic goods is not a watertight compartment okay with the change in time with the change in place and circumstances a free good may be an economic good okay for example water in a river okay it is no doubt it is a free good okay but water in cities in towns it is not a free good because in cities it commands a price okay so anything it commands a price means it is economic good okay similarly air is one of the free goods okay but air in deep mines is an economic good okay oxygen okay oxygen is an free good but in oxygen in hospitals okay so it is economic good 
right so with the change in time with the change in place with the change in circumstances free good may be economic good okay let me discuss another important aspect relating to free goods and economic goods okay please listen carefully okay in your day to day life you have come across many advertisements okay as you know one of the important characteristics of monopolistic competition is advertisement or selling cost so the monopolistic seller okay they offer various attractive services free give, free gifts to increase their sales okay right so when most people talk about free goods they mean the product they do not have to pay for it okay as i have already told you suppose you are purchasing something okay and you are getting some free gifts okay for example toothbrush that come free with a toothpaste okay buying three soaps getting one free okay but the product which comes free with another product are not free goods okay you are not paying price for that product okay that doesn't mean it is a free good okay so free good means it is nature's gift okay but many people have the misconception that free gift means free goods no it's not like that okay because these goods require some resources to produce it okay that means it has some cost of production okay and human effort is needed to produce it so it is not a free good free good are only provided by the nature okay there is no cost of production right so this is all about okay free goods and economic goods see you in the next video thank you have a nice day